Speaker, equal representation of men and women in this parliament is an urgent imperative which will create a culture change. There's the blinkered rejection of quotas and support of the merit myth, but this is more than a numbers game. Across both major parties, the level of regard and respect for women in politics is years behind the business world. Often, when good women call out or are subjected to bad behaviour, the reprisals, backlash and commentary portrays them as the bad ones. The liar, the troublemaker, the emotionally unstable or weak, or someone who should be silenced. To those who say politics is not for the faint-hearted and that women have to toughen up, I say this. The hallmark characteristics of the Australian woman, and I've met thousands of them, be they in my local community, in politics, business, the media or sport, are resilience and a strong, authentic, independent spirit. The voice of the Australian people has been loud and clear. Hundreds from my local community, as well as hundreds more from across Australia, contacted me with their support. And knowing that my life from humble and hardworking migrant heritage has been in the business real world and not as a career politician, many pleaded that I stay in politics and become an independent representative. My sensible centrist values, belief in economic responsibility and focus on always putting the people first and acting in the nation's interest have not changed. The Liberal Party has changed largely due to the actions of the reactionary and regressive right wing who talk about and talk to themselves rather than listening to the people. To continue to put the people before the party and act in the nation's interest authentically and constructively, effective immediately, I will serve as a member of this House of Representatives as an independent representative. I intend to give the government my assurances to confidence and supply. In the new year, I will make a decision about my future career path. Like the three female independent representatives, the new member for Wentworth, the member for Mayo and the member for Indi, sensible centre liberal values are at the core of what I stand for. I am so proud to serve as a member of this House of Representatives with honour and respect because of the good people it represents, the people that the major parties have stopped listening to, the Australian people. I thank you, Mr Speaker.